Hello there, everybody. This is Sneaky Keen here. Hold on just a moment here. Just had to get a little sip of water. And uh, as promised in my last video, you saw my, my Dickies belt clip. Also, quick little note on the hat today. This is a sleeping mask that I am also going to do a review on in the future and uh, did a little showcase and I, I, I like how it feels on my head almost like a hat um, maybe in the future I'll do more of a personal video on why Sneaky Keen enjoys hats so much uh, but today I'm just gonna wear this as if it were a hat because I, I like I said I like the way it feels on my face it calms me down and uh, I think hats make for better reviews so today like I said uh, we're gonna talk about uh, the belt that I bought at Walmart and the problem uh, with buying belts uh, is this is one of my first belts that I bought on my own uh, usually I I would get them uh, I would borrow them from friends or uh, the ones that I had growing up just lasted me up until I was older and now I have it's actually in my pants right now so I'm gonna pull it off here this is my Dickies working belt and I don't use it uh, to, to work. I am not uh, necessarily a construction worker, but this is this is the belt. I'm not sure how to get. Like I said, this review was taken a little while because I was trying to figure out the angle, the proper angle, and I figured out that a wide angle with the camera up. Usually I have the camera, you know, a little bit more down and close and personal to Sneaky Keen, but I figured out that this is the optimal angle for the belt. And um, now here is the problem. The belt itself is actually great quality. Uh, the leather's great. I like this little embossed dickies right there. Uh, and I can see this being a great work belt that lasts me for a few years. But the problem here, the problem, the, the real problem, it really chapped me because I, Sneaky Keen, doesn't get angry very easily, uh, but, and Sneaky Keen usually doesn't have to make returns. Usually Sneaky Keen uh, will just, you, I, I'll buy something and if it doesn't fit or it doesn't work, I'll just, I'll just keep it or give it away as a gift or just something, you know. Um, but I returned the first belt that I bought. Now that's a big deal for me. So th that is actually the main reason why I'm making this review. <sighs> I am a size 32. And as you can see, this is a size 38. But this is the correct size. And the first belt that I bought, I bought as a size 32. Or it might have been. It might have been a 34. Regardless, that belt was not big enough for me, I, I, I put it around my waist and it didn't even meet. It was like that. I felt like a fat person. My whole life I had been skinny, sneaky, keen with the hats. And uh, I was mad. I needed the belt for the very next day for work. Didn't work. Uh, so public service announcement, if you're going to buy a belt, buy it about two sizes maybe three sizes i went three sizes up just to make sure that it would fit me and this one actually might be a little bit too big but better too big than not even able to fit around the waist now that sneaky came for today and we'll see you next time uh with a review uh about masks that can also be hats. Thank you very much for coming out. This was this was Sneaky Keen, and we will 